Hello and welcome back to the newest ICUS Evolution video. Today we are going to cover diameter measurement and defect measurement with the Orpheus camera. So we're going to go ahead and start here. As you can see, I've already got my, my inspection started. It's taken away. We're about 11 minutes in here. I've got my first two observations and I'm ready to enter in my next one. So I'm going to go ahead and enter in my observation here and we're going to go ahead and do a crack. So I'm going to select crack circumferential here and it comes up with this uh, triangle on a ruler here and this is our measurement system button so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this and as you can see my lasers have turned on on the pipe and the software wants us to go ahead and mark those now you want to try and get these as centered as you can on the lasers but if you're a little off it's okay just know that that might lead to a little bit of variation in your measurement uh, and now we just need to go ahead and measure the length of our damage so we're gonna say this brown streak right here is our damage and I'm going to go ahead and put an X at one point and I'm going to put an X at the other point and then it's going to go ahead and give us that measurement so one and a half inches roughly you know it goes to the thousandth place once we have that we're going to go ahead and hit accept measurement right here and it's going to go ahead and import that into our observation now it is also worth noting that we can go up to this start button up here and we can click on again the same symbol right there and select measuring systems and we can select damage measurement right there and it'll bring up the same menu so again we just click on our axis and then we go ahead and do our points here and it gives us roughly the same information there because we were slightly off uh, so that is damage measurement that can be used to measure cracks that can be used to measure uh, gaps in joints and pipes um, it's a super super handy tool all right, so the next measurement we're gonna look at with our Orpheus 2 here is we're gonna go ahead and take a look at diameter measurement. So we're gonna go ahead up to our start button up here at the top, and we're gonna select measuring systems, and we're gonna select diameter measurement. All right, it's warning us that we're out of calibration. We'll cover that here in just a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and hit yes. Now diameter measurement with the Orpheus 2 is as easy as it possibly can be. So you've got two options here. You have nominal diameter less than 20 inches and nominal diameter less than or sorry more than or equal to uh, 20 inches so you really just need to know the general diameter of your pipe it's normally pretty easy to tell if something's less than or more than 20 inches uh, so the pipe we're in is about 10 inches 12 inches we're going to go ahead and hit nominal diameter less than 20 inches on here now our lights are going to go turn off we're going to have a barcode show up at the bottom and it's going to go ahead and do its thing here now that it's all set up and ready to go, we're going to go ahead and hit start measurement. So the camera head's going to begin to rotate, and this is taking an internal measurement of our diameter. Uh, once this finishes up here, we'll have our diameter as well as a cross-section graph, and we'll take a look at that in just a second here. All right, now that this is finished, we can tell down here we've got our measurement results. So we have diameter 11.7 inches, pretty much spot on for this pipe we're using here. And we also have our perimeter in there as well. And you'll notice over here on the right hand side in our working window, we have a cross section. So this is for that specific section that we just measured. Uh, this will also be generated with a profile analysis. Um, but that is a longer, a little bit more in-depth process that we're not going to cover right now. But um, this gives you an idea of the actual shape of your pipe, as well as showing you your large diameter and your small diameter. All right, that was ICUS Evolution Defect in Diameter Measurement with the Orpheus HD Camera or Orpheus Standard F Camera. If you have any questions about anything software related with ICUS, go ahead and reach out to us with the contact information on the screen here. Uh, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.